out. Pies, butters. Butters. Yeah, no done. Thank you very much, my friend. Fantastic. Well, uh, you know, we, we spoke about this in the opening of the show, Saddle Rash. Yeah. Now, we've received some, um, some emails. Yep. Some mostly positive, a couple mm. of negatives. There's mm. some old timers, I think, that, you know, I'm maybe had happy. some sort of connection with the original show. Yes. You yes. know, I grew up watching that and yes. you're making a disgrace and all that sort of shit, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, this is, this is the future. All right, we're here getting it done and we're changing stuff. We're making it better for you. That's right. So uh, the boys, they're out on the high road this week. They are. They're actually traveling uh, to Brown Town mm. this week. And this is around about their, uh, their travels and uh, Lindemann and it's an exciting Gabe and Terry. They're all there. <laughs> all the big names. <laughs> and a couple of new faces popping in today as yep. well. So that's well, right. Without further ado, let's get it done. <laughs> <laughs> Right across the desert on tainted steeds, nothing but bullshit and tumbleweed. Saddle Rash! This week we find our heroes en route with Sheriff Lindemann and his prisoner shitstain heading ever so slowly towards Brown Town. What will happen next? Huh? It's quite remarkable, really. Shitstain, my lover over here, has a rare disease called anus eruptus or exploding clacker. Look at his little face. Poor baby just can't control his bowels, so he spray paints all over the Royal Dalton hourly. Much to the dislike of the uh, Lindemann over here. You got a big mouth, fancy boy, and I will put my nikes in your ass. Perhaps you can get one of those butt plugs I heard about in the paper. They do amazing things. Mm, butt plug. Bitch, don't you have a magazine to read? Eat a piece of shit and die, asshole. Both of you, shut your gaps and enjoy the ride. God damn it, my balls are as big as two samosas right now. Oh. I gotta back one in. I got a turtle head, I'm serious. Oh crap. I'm serious. You're not laying cable in here, young man, that's disgusting. Now, Judy. No, fuck that, you're not snapping one off. I'm not kidding. You gotta untie me. This is this is big time. I gotta sh oh. What the hell is going on down there? <laughs> ah! Whoa! Guys, I think shit's then did it again. He shit all over the place. He spooked my horses with his poopy pants. Look at him go. Let me out! Oh. Oh. Bumpy terrain. Oh, sweet Jesus, let me out. Hello! G'day, mate! Stinky. So stinky. <laughs> God, that stinks! Jeez, he's making a wet dog curry in there or something. Oh, hello. I see you're Jewish. What's the problem here, sweetheart? Yeah, I've busted the camshaft in me Camry. Give me a look here. Ah, yes. You definitely have blown a fuse. That's okay. My cousin Sanjay has a mechanic shop in town. He can help you. Oh, that'd be big, Cobra. Cheers. You hold it right there, you fake-ass Willie Nelson. Screw you, mate. Screw you. Screw you. Screw you, I said. Screw you. You can blow it out your ass, too, if you wanna. Hello. Screw all three of you while we're at it. Well... You got a good point there, fella. Give us a ride into town so I can fix me Camry. I've got an Akadaka concert I've got to get to and uh, no flaming way I'm going to miss it. You can ride me all the way to town. What? Bloody hell, take me gun before I shoot this poof. Hand it over. I'll make sure this one doesn't go off, Pops. Oh. Next time on Saddle Rash, will Shitstain and Lindemann make it to Brown Town in one piece? Join in next time to Saddle Rash! Everything. Well, we, uh, we hope you enjoy it. We're loving it. Yes. If you're sick of it, email us. Tell us. If you don't want us to do it anymore, we'll do something else. Maybe Lassie or something. Start. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Anything. Imagine Lassie like just having like a, g'day fellas, how you going? Like oh, normal kind of voice. Like, Lassie, there's a four at the old mill. Lassie's like, don't care. So? Give me a cigarette. Yeah. I'll bite you. Yeah. I, I lit the fire. <laughs> <laughs> Lassie my little arsonist. Port. Where are we going? Okay, what are we doing? Next segment, bad news. Oh, good. Cool. Give it. Get it done. Bad news. I love, I love it a lot. 
this one caught my attention today while I was having a coffee and not a croissant. Really? I don't even eat croissants. Stop writing in about that. Bagel? No. Okay. An Australian woman's bad body odour which resembles rotting fish. Ooh. Yeah. Unfortunate. She's, she spent uh, what, 41 years looking for an answer for this embarrassing <laughs> BO problem. 41 years! My God. Imagine that, she had to go through primary school. Poor thing. She had to go through high school. It's like, imagine the names. What's that older? You know, like yeah. trying to get a boyfriend, looking for a date at prom night, boom! Nothing yeah. doing. Anyway, fishy woman. That's, I, don't, I don't, haven't said her name, but anyway, she's actually been diagnosed. It's legit. Okay. So she's feeling happy about that. It's uh, fish malodor syndrome. Oh, it's a good name. Yeah. Fish malodor. And apparently she's she's not the only one out there. Fish malodor. I know malodor, isn't that? It's like, I suffer wrong. from malodor. It's syndrome. like what they call like, you know, when you get like a nose job, it's called rhinoplast. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like fish malodor. I know. Sorry, love, you got fish malodor. But anyway, she's feeling a oh, little really? bit better because, you know, for years she's just been dropping into doctors like, excuse me, doc, I got this small problem. He's like, and the doc's like, what that problem? Smell? Did you? Did I you, can't smell a thing. Did you step in something on your way in, yeah. Sally? <laughs> and Sally's always this was dinner was terribly night. embarrassed about this. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, she's um, she's found out what it is, and it's legit, and she's joined an internet-based support group with people with the same or similar conditions. So, all right, hmm, that's good. Imagine those meetings. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Imagine the meetings. You know, fish people. Fish people. You got. Um, gym shoes, wet people, do wet dog, wet dog, people. Yeah. All right, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> light some insect, you know that yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, we, we need we need a solution for it, and uh, I, I believe I've got it. What is it? Uh, if, I mean, like, there's a lot of bad smelling people out there. I mean, mm. West End. <laughs> just come straight here, grow Hello. some dreadlocks, put on some patchouli, and you'll fit yeah. right in, love. It's part of uh, Rumpus TV. You know, we're always looking out for the community. We'd like to help. <laughs> we're going to send you out a liter of patchouli oil, yep. free of charge. We know where you live, fishwoman. It's coming your way. There that's, you go, fish fingers. That's bad news, fish, no fish fingers. <laughs> Get it done. Bad news. All right, okay. well, it's, uh, you know, we do get letters here, believe it or not. We do. And this week we had the, uh, I don't know if you watched last week's show, if you did, we had, uh, what was his, Quinzalis? Quinzales from the came Island in. Vibe Festival. He gave us two tickets to give away. Now we ran a competition. You know, we had people calling, trying to be sneaky. They didn't want to. They didn't want to get involved and do what they had to do. They just yep. wanted the yep. tickets. No, no, it doesn't work like that. The rules the stipulated yeah. that you must be wearing your tiniest pair of shorts mm -hmm. and your teeny beady bikini. Tick. That's all Tick. you had to do. It wasn't hard. But only one man stood up. <laughs> One man, and his name was Lachlan. And he went overboard. He went a little too far. He even put a flower in the hair. Let's have a look at it. There it is. Oh, that's disgraceful. My God. Let's have a look at it again. <laughs> that is disgraceful. He's Isn't even it? like patted the bra. I like. know. And, and, the, and his little smile too. You can he's see like, his little... Oh, yeah. you know? Actually, he's giving thumbs up. Yeah. What a champion. So he has won the tickets. Lachlan, congratulations, man. You're going to Island Vibe. It's going to be a good time. Don't wear that. <laughs> <laughs> wear something, but don't wear that. It's not like that. Well, if you're going to wear that, wear a lot of sunblock because yeah, or, you're going to be shredded. Or a big hat yeah. or something. Anyway, or those, a garbage bag. those denim pants really setting standards. So uh, <laughs> there you go. Congratulations. And uh, we'll be in touch soon with those tickets. Sweet. Stupid Postman, close it. Close it. No, the man. Stupid Postman! Boom Shanker, that was a stupid post, man. If you've got any letters or any ideas or anything that you want to write in about, check out our website and write us in a letter. We love hearing from you. Anyway, we've got to go to our second ad. So, Butters, take us to the bridge! Oh. Hi, Shanker Shanker.